<laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> there were a bunch of turkeys out. Oh, I'll probably being probably to. Oh, were they? All right, you got all your warm stuff on. We got our bag of goodies. We've got a bow. Well, it's Friday, January 7th, and Bryn and I are back out on the home farm. This is Bryn's third sit of the year. We've been trying to get her her first deer, and we haven't quite got it done yet. Um, last time we were trying to hold out for a buck. I think today we might go ahead and shoot a doe early if we can. She does have two tags. She has a youth season tag that's good during any season, and then a late muzzy tag. And I was thinking we'd shoot a doe with one and maybe try to shoot a buck with the other. We're still pretty excited about Bella getting patient X last night. That was the first thing Bryn said when I picked her up from school today. I picked her up a little bit early so we could sneak out here. We got out of here about 2.30. And just like yesterday, you know, with these ideal conditions, the deer are moving so early. And there was probably 10 deer in the food plot at 2.30 and one of them was Big Mac. He was like 30 yards in front of the blind. So I think just the doe really saw that it was people walking up the hill and we were able to get in the blind and I could see all the deer just right down below us. I haven't laid eyes on Big Mac again yet, but we've already got deer back out in the plot. It's a temperature of 10 degrees. We got a light south wind and it's really high pressure still. So pretty ideal conditions. And uh, we're looking forward to the sit. Shoot that. 
big one. Yeah, right behind the leg. Go ahead and shoot her. Good job. <coughs> you got her, baby. Look at her. Look, watch her. Watch her. She's just moving. Watch her. 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 You got her, Bran. You got your first pair, baby. Oh, she's just she's just running. Yeah. She's gonna follow you. Yeah, you got her. You got your first pair. Yeah. <laughs> you did it. You did it. Get over there, Ryan. Right? <laughs> that was so loud. You did it, Brian. Yay! It was so loud that I that like all the deer ran. Yeah, and sometimes when one deer runs, they all run. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got your first deer. <laughs> That's so good, baby. <laughs> what do you think, Bren? <laughs> well, we succeeded. Uh, lots of challenges um, with, you know, trying to get Britain's first deer down. We, she's learning a lot. These blinds really make it possible to be able to talk and teach. And had a lot of does and that broken G three buck that we've seen a few times. That's he looks like it. He's at least a four and a half year old. Um, we were trying to be patient and let him move up, and he got to about forty. And Bryn just said, I really want to shoot a girl deer. You know, some of the challenges of having 40 deer in a food plot, you know, this late season weather has really got them feeding hard and the beans are disappearing pretty rapidly. Um, the doe that we had picked out that was standing all by itself, um, something got them to get a little squirrely and they all kind of bunched up. So I was calling her off because I didn't, I didn't want her to um, shoot that deer with, with the deer right behind it, obviously. And so when they, they, some of them started to trot, there was another big doe that turned broadside. And so we had to switch off of that one to the one behind her. And she ended up hitting the deer back, but uh, thankfully she hit it just beneath the spine and cut that aorta. And uh, I could tell that right away with the blood coming out of both sides. So we watched her go down right here. And a um, lot, of, lot of moving parts in that situation, but she was successful, got her first deer down, and we're gonna get out and go recover it. What do you want to say? And I shoot a grandma deer. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> um, What do you think, Bryn? It's so fun. Yeah. <laughs> I shoot her my first stand and I ain't her grand. Guys, she's a grandma. Yeah. <laughs> so she just made it about 20 yards off the field edge and we watched her fall. Uh, like I said, the shot was a little bit back, but it went right over the spine and, and cut that aorta. So she, she died really quick. And I think that had something to do with a lot of the commotion in the blind, even though it was a 20-yard shot. And just having to switch deer and the deer getting... Uh, a little spooky she kind of rushed a little bit but you know I'm, I'm really proud of her uh, it's her third sit this year and got her first year down and she wanted to shoot a big doe and dad can certainly use the help taking some does off of this property so yeah oh, that was it's uh fun. below zero right now so we're all getting kind of cold we're gonna get her in the back of the Kubota and get out of here good job Bernie can I get a Whoa. hug can I get a big hug from you Oh, I love you, little girl. <laughs>